Disability advocates in Ontario are saying that this is the most important election in decades based on promises that have been made in the past and the timeline that had been set out to make things more accessible. Today, I had a chance to speak with David Lepofsky, the chair of the AODA Alliance, about his disappointment so far and his expectations. Everybody either has a disability now or gets one later, so we're actually the minority of everyone. Issues that relate to people with disabilities affect everyone. We are almost to election day. Advanced polling has started at this point, obviously. Uh, you're of the mind, though, that there hasn't been enough discussion about uh, disabilities and those affected with disabilities in this province and how things can be bettered for them. Why? We wrote all the parties almost six months ago asking for detailed commitments, asking for their plans. All the parties except one answered us. The Liberals, Greens and NDP answered and made detailed commitments. The Conservatives under Doug Ford have refused to even answer. And that's after Premier Ford, during four years in office, refused to even meet with us. Thanks so much. 2005 was a big year because in that year, thanks to a decade of our uh, lobbying, the Ontario legislature unanimously passed a law called the Accessibility for Ontarians with Disabilities Act. It requires the Ontario government to lead this province to become fully accessible to people with disabilities by 2025. Whoever gets elected on June 2nd is going to be in power when we reach that deadline. What exactly are you looking for from these parties that they can do in the short term? We've heard party leaders promising, including the Premier, promising to build new hospitals, new public transit, new schools. But the government has not committed to ensure that that new construction built with our money will be accessible to people with disabilities. We want the next government to guarantee that they will not use our money to make things worse for us. When you speak of someone with a disability, what are you talking about exactly? Talk about people who are blind, like me, or who are deaf, or who use a wheelchair or a, motor, uh, or a scooter or a walker, or people uh, with uh, a neurological disability like autism, people with intellectual disability, people with a mental health condition, people with learning disability, the whole spectrum of any kind of disability um, is what we're talking about. And we want to make sure that people can live in a society that fully includes them. That's what the province unanimously promised to us back in 2005. And we need the next government to have a plan of action, especially because we're so far behind.